My name is Pete Margaritas, and I'm the last speaker for this TED Talk series. But before I begin, I would like to personally thank the MACPA for all of their hard work that they've done to put this Innovation Summit together. I'd also like to thank all of you for taking time out of your busy schedule to come here and attend this conference. So a round of applause for everybody. And a round of applause for lunch because I think we have a choice between chicken, chicken, and then more chicken. I'm here to talk to you today briefly about how to embrace your inner superhero. And you might be sitting there thinking, I'm a CPA. What does that have to do with being a superhero? We're not superheroes. Some of us might do superheroes' taxes, right? Batman, how many times have I told you you can't write off Wayne Manor? Only the Batcave has a home office deduction. And remember, Robin, remember, Bennett, Robin does not qualify as an independent contractor. Pay your payroll taxes. Superheroes have it easy compared to the strength that it takes to be a CPA. I'm a CPA. I've been in public. I've been in industry. I've been in higher education. I've done a lot. And I understand the stresses that we deal with as CPAs day in and day out. And on top of that, with those stresses, finding time to innovate and be creative. I mean, does anybody feel like CPA stands for consistently punched in the abs? I mean, Superman had to deal with Lex Luthor. Hey, Superman, I know you're more powerful than a locomotive, but I'd like to see you interpret the minutia in the Dodd-Frank bill. Any tax law changes, any changes in U.S. gap. Yeah, right, Superman. You'd be flying back to Krypton in a nanosecond. Batman had to deal with the Joker. But I'd like to see Batman deal with some of our millennial staff. If Robin acted like Bat, if Robin acted like our millennial staff, he'd sound something like this. Uh, hey, Batman, why do I have to be Robin? Like, I don't want to be Robin. I want to be Batman now and not wait till you retire. And Batman's shaking his head going, holy, you get a trophy for last place. Then you've got Spider-Man. Spider-Man had to deal with the Green Goblin. The Green Goblin has nothing over the hundreds of time robbers that affect our day and in many cases turn it into a 17-hour workday. You know something? We CPAs, we are superheroes. And we deserve, because we are superheroes, our own movie. Faster than an IRS audit. More powerful than an Excel pivot table. Able to leap all accounting acronyms in a single bound. Look, over there by Starbucks. Who is that? That's Super CPA, the strange CPA from Planet Extrovertius, who came to Earth with these strong powers of communicating, these strong skills of problem solving, who can stop high turnover in his tracks who can focus on an office distraction despite focus on an office task despite of all the distractions and still find time to innovate. It's super CPA. And we're all super CPA. And we need our own movie. Don't you agree? We need our own movie. You know what? We all are super CPAs. And because we all are super CPAs, we all need a shirt that says Super CPA. I would like everybody to stand up, please. Once again, we're going to get the blood moving again. Repeat after me. I am a Super CPA. Okay, this time with some passion and some heart. I am a Super CPA. I am a Super CPA. Now go and innovate. Thank you all very much.